gon' get rich quicker From the land, ain't no city bigger Foreign cars pullin' in a villa Who smellin' good? I'm that nigga I'ma cut right to the chase The stud is dropping in the next two weeks and if you watch one of my previous videos, I said if you pre-order the stud, you can get a sample of the jock for free. The jock don't come out for another four to five a month. So if you wanna be ahead of the curve and you wanna keep up with the latest fragrances in Christopher Lee's collection, I would suggest you go pre-order the stud because you only have two weeks left to cash in on this reward. Also, Speaking about samples, I'm coming out with a sample 5ml version of every scent on the website. So if you want to sample the boss or sample the stud, you can get you a $10 sample of it, send it to your house. You try it out, you come up with your opinions, and then whenever you're ready to buy a full bottle, you can come back to the website. Also, I'm coming out with a hundred ml bottle it's probably gonna run y'all 120 to 130 dollars but i'm trying to work with factories to get the prices even lower so i'm trying to get it around 100 price point and i also want the boss to hover around 60. so once i get and being able to buy my fragrances in a bigger bulk then i'll be able to lower the price for y'all okay another thing i want to talk about is i just purchased five new fragrances all from Tom Ford. I got this baby right here. I can't pronounce the name. You know what I'm saying? But it's the goat. Like, oh shit, it's another box. It's the gold bottle Tom Ford. Pick that up. I also I also picked up Jasmine Rouge, which is a very unique scent. Mm, that's just different. Also picked up Electric Cherry by Tom Ford and Smoke Cherry or Cherry Smoke. And you know, I always had Lost Cherry. So, you know, when I do a versus with all three of these, we can pick out which one is the best one. And I also had, and I also grabbed this Tom Ford as well. Can't pronounce the name, so I don't want to butcher it and y'all be on my ass about how I didn't say it right. But you can tell out the gate that it's going to be a summer scent. And this is the first fresh Tom Ford I smelt in a long time, besides Tom Ford Gray Vetiver. I am not wearing this today. I'm also waiting for a new Bloody Chanel to drop. I'm kind of confused on that. I don't know if they're gonna come out with like a Bloody Chanel Elixir or a Bloody Chanel Cologne, but are they done with Bloody Chanel? Same thing with Dior Sauvage. They did end it off with Lixer, so what they gonna do is they gonna keep dropping more fragrances or they gonna come out with a new line? Comment below. Like I said, I think Johnny Depp is coming out with a new, is, is he just, Johnny Depp just signed a new deal with Sauvage for $20 million. So Sauvage gotta be coming out with another fragrance or they got more stuff they coming out with, maybe a body wash or something like that. I also, I also want to know what type of content y'all want to look for. You know what I'm saying? I know y'all been getting bored of the cut on game. All we do is wait for the new fragrances to come out and tell y'all. But what other content would y'all like in between talking about a new release? You let us know. What do y'all want to see? You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of these fragrance reviewers, all we got to do is just talk about the top 10 and the new fragrances. So what do y'all want? Y'all want fragrance news, like daily fragrance news? What y'all want? Let me know and make it happen. All right, quick little video, you know what I'm saying? Just to catch y'all up on things. I'm Big Boss. If you like this video, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. But I'm still in that cave Fuck all the talking and fuck all the talking and fuck all the walking Got money to make Fuck on a bitch and I don't do a day Came off the streets and I'm paving my way Yeah, you on top, but I'm counting your days Yeah, you on top, but I'm counting your days Came to the party with no gun Left the party with a